Greetings and best wishes for a happy holiday season from all of us at 2K Sports as we get set for this NBA presentation. I'm Kevin Harlan alongside Richard Jefferson and Greg Anthony. And with us from the sidelines tonight, David Aldridge. Here are the starters for Brooklyn. We've got Mikel Bridges. Thomas is out there with Martin. And there's Kemba Walker. And it's Simmons in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. And for Cleveland, at the guard positions, it's Garland and Mitchell. Evan Mobley is out there with Tobias Harris. And it's MP in at center. And Greg, with back-to-back -back games part of the schedule, how do teams feel getting into the latter part of that combo, unlike tonight? Well, these games can be especially taxing mentally and physically. At this point, it's a war of attrition, and really, who can survive the night? MP with a screen on Walker. 13 feet away. Garland with the bucket. Garland's got the first basket of the game for the Cavs. You've got to be right on Garland from that mid-range spot because he is lethal from there. Garland against Walker. And it's Bridges at the elbow. It doesn't go for him. For the Nets, they come into this one following a loss to the Hornets. That's good by Mitchell. That's cash. Mitchell is a volume three-point shooter for a reason now. To the middle, here's Simmons, and the rejection by MP. That's out of bounds. Brooklyn will retain possession. And right now, let's watch that terrific swat. And an early swat like that can really set the tone. Now the shooters will be feeling his presence. It's the Nets now. It's a five-point game. Back to Martin. Now the pass to Thomas. And the three off target. Cleveland has come out of the gates quickly. Inside. Here's MP. That drops and it comes off an assist from Garland. And creating a little separation here. Gaining some confidence. Yeah, they rocked in during this stretch. If they keep it up, their lead will only continue to grow. And they are very comfortable running their offense through walk. And you can see why. Drops a sick dime right there. That pass was right on the money. Down low, MP. And there's a whistle, and that's going to go on Simmons. That is his first foul of the game. First 130 gone here in the first quarter. And Garland has it in the corner. Mobley misses. Over Cleveland, their last game, a win against the Bulls in Chicago. Bridges kicks to Walker. Outside Thomas. Shot clock at six. Baseline J on the way. It's rebounded by Cleveland. This game coming on the heels of their win against Chicago. Yeah, and with most of the arena against them, they just banded together and trusted one another to make the right play. Even with all that noise, when they had the ball, it never rattled them. Their offense was in tune like it was a home game. Bridges outside. The Nets working the ball around now. That's good from Thomas on the assist by Walker. Yeah, I mean, Kemba has a talent for spotting these opportunities, moving the ball to a guy who's ready to strike. And, Greg, you talk about rim protection. Cleveland can really shut down the lane, can't they? Yeah, I mean, they have the personnel to do it. Big front court and good guards who can keep ball handlers in front of them. A solid athlete. MP is more than capable of these types of throwdowns. And that last look brought to you by the AT&T 5G Slam King. Bridges. The rebound by Mitchell. And you got to give credit to the D for never giving up on the play and doing just enough to bother him at the rim. And stolen by Simmons. Thomas surveying the D. Pass to Walker. Walker. 
back to Thomas. Shot clock at five. Dishes it to Simmons. Up and in. Off to an efficient start. Two for three from the field. Looks like it could be a big night for him. Very strong start here in the first quarter. MP with a screen on Walker. At the elbow, it's MP. And MP throws it down. Oh, if you're smart, you're going to want to cover MP when he gets inside. But this man, he will still manage to outwork you. And so Thomas will bring it up for Brooklyn. Trailing by four. To the paint. Here's Simmons. And Simmons slams it in. Authoritative move by Simmons. Throwing it down on the defense. MP with a screen on Walker. To the inside. Here's MP. And MP throws it down. Get him the ball anywhere close to the hoop. That thing is over. Nets trail by four. And the Nets decide to take their first time out here. Defeated by the Hornets in their last game, they'll try to put that one behind them. Yeah, I mean, their execution at times was flawless, but they also made some mistakes that ultimately did them in. And it's just a couple of bad breaks, and then you're on the losing end. I'm sure they're going to bounce back quickly. Okoro's checked in for Harris. Thomas finds Simmons. Outside Thomas. Back to Simmons. Just five to shoot. With the crossover and block. That one goes careening off the glass. MP passes to Mitchell. Screen by MP. Mobley outside. MP again. MP's got 10 points. And the league is still buzzing, Greg, about MP. Registering a quadruple double. One of the greatest all-around games in league history. MP is an incredible talent. And you know he'll put on another show here tonight. Thomas passes to Simmons. And Simmons slams it in. And, and although an undersized center, more than making up for it with some serious hops. Simmons against MP. Down low. Fouled in the act of shooting. Gets the bucket anyway, so a three-point play chance for him. What an effort by Garland battling through the foul to get his shot off. And Darius Garland, no doubt a point guard on the rise. Yeah, I think this guy's future is really promising, and it's because of his strong work ethic, his desire to keep working on his game and get better. Now, here's Thomas. He's coming off a 22-point game against Charlotte. Back to Bridges. Lock at six. Feeds to Simmons. That's good. And it's Thomas picking up the assist. He's got ten. And he has been on fire this quarter in terms of his scoring. Hopefully that fire spreads to his other guys and they can rally. And he just dangles from the bucket after sending that one through. And you can see which team has the swagger right now. Now here's Walker. No scoring in this one. He dishes it to Bridges. Outside for Martin. Here's Simmons. And it's MV with the rebound. You know, you just can't say enough about the statistical marks that MP is putting up. I mean, Greg, this is just amazing stuff. How about his 20, 20, and 20 triple-double? I've never said that before. I mean, this is incredible. And Kevin, something we'd only seen from the likes of Wilt and Westbrook, right? That's the kind of dynamic, prolific dominance you've got to exhibit to manufacture a stat line like that. Excellent all-around performance so far, hence the big lead. They got off to such a hot start, and that can keep you energized throughout the whole game. Now here's Simmons, and Simmons slams it in. 
And though he loves to keep his teammates involved, Simmons... Oh, oh my goodness, the slam! Oh. I like their focus coming in. Terrific execution so far. Couldn't come up with a much better start than this. They just have to keep it going. Here's Martin. He had a 12-point outing in their last game against Charlotte. He's more than chipped in on the glass as well. Just a tremendous effort last time out. Now, here's MP after Ben Simmons' miss. And there's the bucket from MP. MP's got 18 points in the game. And now we'll get a perspective here on how the hustle game has been going for the Cavaliers. The enthusiasm they've brought to their defense so far is something else. Going after shooters and really hustling to get their hands on shots. And they are also just outworking the opposition in transition. When the break is on, they've continued to find ways to score. Nets trail by 13. They've been looking out of sync offensively. Yeah, the, the, their offense has ground to a standstill. Bridges, no one around him. No good on the triple. And here's MP. He'll bring it up for the Cleveland Cavaliers. MP with video game numbers. How about the 60, 20, and 10 tripled up? An all-time game in league history. MP just doing everything. This guy is a human cheat code. And the dunk by MP. And defensively with Mobley, it's not just the length. It's the anticipation. It's the high basketball IQ. This man will beat you mentally and physically. Outside, Walker. And it's Bridges at the elbow. Back to Walker. Bridges a screen on Garland. And Walker kicks to Simmons. Fires the three. And a rebound goes to the Cavaliers. They're getting their first look of the season at the Nets in this one. And they usually came out on top when these two teams faced off last year. No surprise, they're the better team. That is some tough defense there against one of the better finishers in our game. On the wing, Bridges. Thomas passes to Bridges. Inside, the kick out to Walker. They could use a bucket. And a rebound goes to the Cavaliers. MP's got nine rebounds in the game. Getting it done. Mitchell. Good, and it's MP picking up the assist. MP's got his third assist on the night. Nets trail by 17. Now, here's Walker. He had 15 points last out. Simmons sets a screen for Walker. Here's Bridges. And so it's MP making things happen for the Cleveland Cavaliers. And the blocks just kept on coming for him. He's playing some fantastic D. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. And welcome back to the second quarter of action. Plenty of basketball left to play, but this one has been... The Cavaliers will go with a different look here. MP's checked in for Jared Allen. Harris comes in for Max Struess. Donovan Mitchell's checked in for Isaac Okoro. And it's Garland in for Curry. Then for the Nets, Simmons checked in for Sharp. Thomas comes in for Dwight Powell. And Walker subbed in for Whitehead. At the guard positions, it's Garland and Mitchell. Evan Mobley is out there with MP. And it's Harris in at the small forward. So that's who's on the floor for the Cavaliers. Time now to turn to our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David. Thanks very much. MP in the last game against Chicago was sensational. He ended up with 62 points. And the points were just the start of it. He joined an elite few by walking away with a quadruple double. Just a fantastic night for him. A guy he wants to have every night, I'm sure. Hey guys? Thank you, David. You're right. He was a one-man wrecking crew in that one. Yeah, he was not going to let them lose that game. We'll see if he comes in with that same attitude tonight. And I'll be interested to see if the opposition looks to double him because this should open up opportunities for his teammates to get going. What a streak this team is on. One away from an even 
20. MP will be looking to make that a reality tonight. And this whole time, they've been on the streak. We've seen everyone step up when called upon. Jared Allen's checked in for the Cavaliers. And the Nets also making a change. Martin's checked in for Bridges. Thomas dishes to Walker. Back to Thomas. Simmons finds Thomas. Here's Finney Smith. That one falls, coming off of Thomas's feet. Thomas got his fifth assist in this one. Cavaliers leading. MP with a screen on Walker. The wide open look here for Garland. Cleveland gets it back. And the rebound paying off as they pick up two on the second chance bucket right there. That scoreless first quarter, that might have woke him up, and he's turned it on here in the second. Walker against Garland. Thomas, it's a wide open look, and there's a whistle, and that's going to go on Simmons. That'll be his second foul of the game. Cleveland leading by three. Garland with it. Goes up on the block. MP, no good. And here are the Nets. They're on a 20-7 run. To the paint. Here's Martin. And finished off by Martin. And despite the size disadvantage, attacking the heart of that defense. Really unfazed. Throw his height right out the window there. And Simmons has got the ball here for the Nets. Looking ahead, they've got the Jazz coming into town for the next game. That'll be the first of two straight at home. Screen by Simmons. Six on the shot clock. Over MP. And the rejection by MP. And Cameron Thomas picks up the foul. That is his first foul of the game. RJ, so much goes into extending an NBA playing career. What was the key for you in your long career? Well, for me, physically, I had to start doing more things away from the game of basketball. Doing yoga, doing strength training, but also the changes mentally. I went from a 20-point-a-game scorer to a guy that was getting three or four shots a game. You have to be able to accept your role and then star in your role. And for me, I just love doing that. Passes to Walker. Outside, Martin. Pass to Simmons. Too long in the paint, and he's hit with a three-second violation. And this is his first trip to the line tonight. And the technical free throw is good. Yeah, nice job of drawing the contact and creating opportunities at the line. Mobley, he's checked in for the Cavaliers. And a switch here for Brooklyn. Bridges checks in, and that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle, and two shots coming up. It's going to be on Donovan Mitchell. And Bridges continues to be more adept at picking up fouls. Such a clever offensive player. And while we see a number of players get hurt during the season, Richard, Mikael Bridges has remained very durable. He's just an old-school player. That's what they used to do. If you were healthy, you played in every single game, and he's found ways to stay healthy. Nice feed by MP, a popular guy in this locker room. And Walker kicks to Thomas. On the wing, Bridges. Back to Thomas. Driving inside. Good D by Mobley. The game has been very close in a lot of areas, but rebounding has been the one differentiator thus far. Picks it out to Garland. Drains it from beyond the arc. Garland's got eight points. Quick release jumper from Garland there, showing how fast he can get rid of it. Garland against Walker. And then Simmons slams it in. Yeah, whenever Simmons gets a chance to show off his insane jumping skills, he sees it. And the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by MP. And a look now at some of the players we can expect to see in this year's dunk contest. Always one of the great events of All-Star Weekend. It is, Kevin. You just can't take your eyes off it. The ideas those guys come up with and then the guts it takes to pull them off always blows me away. You look at MP. 
Some might say he's a long shot at this point, but you never know. Hey, stranger things have happened, and we'll just have to wait and see. And so that's the breakdown as it currently stands. We'll be keeping you all updated with the latest info and, of course, our final list of contestants as we get closer. Yeah, and if they don't invite me to be a judge, I, I'm still going. And what you appreciate about MP is how even keeled he is. He's someone his guys love playing with. Here's Simmons. And it's MP with the rebound. MP's got 13 rebounds in the game. Class eating. Mobley left side on the way, Harris. Here's MP. And the dunk by MP. You can see the competitive nature for MP right now. He's locked in and looking to add his scoring totals on every trip down. To the middle, here's Simmons, and they call the foul, so a chance at the line for one more coming up. And guys, they continue to put a lot of pressure on the interior defenders with their work down low. This trip is his second to the free throw line in this one. Stolen by Walker. The feed to Simmons. There's the dish to Thomas. Out to Bridges. Mitchell against Thomas. Left side Walker over Harris. And no luck with that time on the buzzer beater. So the clock runs out with the score tied going into halftime. Stay with us, folks. We'll get back just after halftime to start the third quarter. They're playing that big boy ball going right to the chest of the defenders, making their presence felt on the interior. And we... All right, guys, now let's take a... Thanks for joining us. Now... And if you're just joining us, we've played through the first half in a game that's been fairly even so far. You look at MP in this one, he's been everywhere. Well, with a double-double in hand through two quarters, you can just imagine what his stat line will look like at the end of this one. But I don't think that that's the most important thing to him. Sure, putting up big numbers doesn't hurt, but he's all about getting the win over everything else. Second half underway. Here's who Jock Bond's got on the floor. Kayla Martin out there with Ben Simmons. Then it's Bridges. Then it's Thomas, and it's Walker in at the point. Inside, here's Simmons. It counts, and the foul. It's going to be on MP. Yeah, how about that? Simmons stays strong and gets the end one chance. This will be his third free throw shot of the game. Not the best statistic for him in terms of his performance at the line. Very low numbers. MP sets the screen for Mitchell. Off target with his three. The Nets with the lead. Down low, here's Simmons. That falls. Nice feed that time from Walker. That's now 26 points for Ben Simmons. Al Cleveland shooting has been fun to watch in this game. They're 57%. A moment now to hear from our sideline reporter, Hall of Famer, David Aldridge. David. Thank you, Kevin. Jared Allen is earning his keep in the painted area. He said from a young age, that was instilled in me. The footwork as a big... Back to the basket. I'm trying to find it in the flow of the offense. I don't want to disrupt this to where I'm getting in people's way. I just want to find my spot. Kevin? And he does it well. D.A., thank you. Outside Garland. They grab their own miss. And Cameron Thomas picks up the foul. That's foul number two for him. And we're just about a minute and a half into the third quarter of basketball. Here's MP. MP strong inside. Look, they are in front right now because of him. He keeps draining these shots at a ridiculous clip. Now a timeout call by Brooklyn. And we've got a quick moment now to take a look at the long-term rebounding numbers over several seasons for Jared Allen. We've seen him regress as a rebounder these past few seasons. 
His numbers have come down in that department, and I'd like to see him concentrate on bringing them back up. I'm sure the team would as well. You can never have enough rebounds. For Cleveland, they've gone three or six in the third quarter, 50% from the field. Driving in hard. Harris beats them with a little bit of speed and a little bit of intensity right there. Brooklyn's gone past the three-point line for 13 of their shots. Six of 13. Simmons and foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. And it'll be his fourth time going to the free-throw line in the game. Nope. And here's Bridges. He'll bring it up for Brooklyn. They've got MP. Mitchell is out there with the coral. Then there's Allen. And it's Harris in at the three spot. That's the five for Cleveland right now. Mitchell passes to MP. On the wing, Harris. Finney Smith defending. And there's the bucket from MP. They're in strong position coming down the stretch, and he is a big reason why. And for the Nets, they're shooting not great, 40% for the game. The pass to Finney Smith. And here's Sharp. Here's Whitehead. Allen with the rebound. Yeah, and they've shown effort and aggression in the paint, really, right from the tip. Their rebounding edge right now, massive. And out of bounds as Brooklyn gains possession. And here's what the Cleveland Cavaliers schedule looks like. On Monday, they'll begin a road trip starting in Indiana, going up against the Pacers. And looking at the Boston matchup, it won't be an easy one given it is coming on the back end of a back-to-back. -back. But they've been playing some fantastic basketball lately. And when you are winning back-to-backs, you're feeling good about yourself. Bridges left side. Six to shoot. Whitehead passes to Bridges. And it's off from three-point range. The Cavaliers leading by 22. And the basket by MP. MP's got 33. Man, you watch MP. He is so talented. And this man, man, let me just tell you, he's determined. Bridges against Mitchell. Bridges passes to Pop. There's Whitehead. In the corner, it's Bridges. It's good from long range. Bridges. Drilling it from that coffin corner. Bridges wants that shot and searches it out. Mitchell passes to Okoro. And they double up MP. Okoro kicks to Mitchell. Cleveland moving the ball around. And MP throws it down. MP has to be happy about that result. This man went up high for the finish. Brooklyn's gone one or two from three-point range here in the fourth. Bridges passes to Whitehead. Seen players criticized for skipping their media obligations after tough losses, Greg. How egregious is that in, in your opinion? Well, you know, they say the true test of character is how you respond to when things aren't going your way. So for me, it's important to be accountable in those tough moments. And we gotta take a second look to admire that outstanding block. And this is how you protect and grow a lead by making a huge effort on that end of the floor. Curry's checked in for a Coral. And Simmons, he's checked in for the Nets. Around three minutes gone here in the fourth quarter. And another turnover here by Brooklyn. And so it's Cleveland with it. And the dunk by MP. Loading up to stop Mitchell can lead to big breakdowns defensively. The Nets have gone two for five on field goal attempts in the fourth quarter. Vinny Smith passes to Sharp. Pass to Powell. Outside, Simmons. Three-pointer. 
and it's MV with the rebound. MP's got his 20th rebound here tonight. Saw that coming. And MP throws it down. It's great whenever a big knows how to handle it. Allen sharing the wealth. Over three and a half minutes through the final quarter now. Pass to Powell. Jared Allen grabs the miss. Allen's got nine rebounds in the game. Getting it done. He gets that one. MP's got 41. The ball movement on this run has been fantastic and is a big part of why they've been able to get these good looks. To the paint. Pass to Sharp. Feeds it to Powell. Good. Nice job down low. At 6'10", Simmons, Simmons sees the entire floor at all times. The Cavaliers have gotten absolutely red hot shooting the ball here in the fourth. A perfect six for six. Curry passes to MP. Kicks it out to Mitchell. Good in the assist goes to MP. MP's got his seventh assist here tonight. Outside, Simmons. Bridges a screen on Harris. Simmons passes to Powell. And the dunk by Powell. He finds a shooter in motion and is confident he can thread him with the lead pass. Well done. And so it's Mitchell who brings up the ball for the Cleveland Cavaliers. Next game, they'll take on the Pacers in Indianapolis at Cambridge Fieldhouse. That'll be just one game played away from home for them. Oh, that's an old-fashioned rim rack. Uh, just a remarkable jam. These fans' jaws are on the ground right now. And on the AT&T 5G Slam Cam, you can see how impressive that move was. Tries from 10. No good from Simmons. And here are the Cavaliers. They're on a 17-7 run. Allen finds MP. And MP throws it down. Looks like somebody came out this half on a mission. And his intensity on offense has been fun to watch. Curry against Bridges. There's the pass to Simmons. Here's Sharp. And he gets the basket. Officials blowing the whistle, so a chance at the line for one more. One of Simmons' best attributes is his ability to distribute. And the Cavaliers with some changes. Max Truce has checked in for Harris. Okoro comes in for Donovan Mitchell. And it's Ty Jerome in for Curry. The Nets also changing it up. Kayla Martin's checked in for Powell. Cameron Thomas comes in for Ben Simmons. And Walker subbed in for Dorian Finney-Smith. Not surprised at all. He's shooting it well and scoring points in bunches. For Brooklyn, they've gone 5 of 11 from the field in the fourth quarter. Now Walker. So here's one for you, RJ. Is there anyone in the league right now that reminds you of yourself as a player? Now, if we're talking about me in my prime, and I hope these players don't get disrespected, but Jalen Brown and Andrew Wiggins. Just the way they play, some of the moves that they make, like I can see myself doing those things. The Nets making a switch here. Simmons has checked in. Down to five on the shot clock. Here's Thomas. So it looks like the Nets will retain possession here. Oh, great job by MP to read the play and be in the right spot there to get the block. Stolen by a Coro. And here is MP. To the inside, Allen. And Allen sends it in. What coaches love about Allen is he finds points. You don't have to run a ton of stuff for him. Brooklyn's gone one of three from outside the arc since we've reached the fourth quarter. And Walker kicks to Martin. Back to Walker. And the rejection by MP. Now Cleveland moving it up. Locked up there for Allen. Bridges with the steal. Now here's Simmons for the three. And there's Bridges on the assist by Simmons. Simmons got five assists tonight. 
This demonstrates how confident Bridges has become. Knows he has a green light to fire away. So nice passing by Cleveland here. And MP throws it down. And he just big boyed it right there. The height advantage he's got down low. Really difficult for them to defend. Brooklyn's gotten off four three-pointers in the final quarter, and two of them have fallen. Inside, stolen by Okoro. Here's MP. There's the drive. Yeah, MP races in and goes straight up, catching the defense. Man, they were not focused. To the paint, here's Bridges. The shot's good on the assist by Walker. Walker's got assist number 11 for him here tonight. And obviously his momentum from the last game has carried over here tonight. He's just riding the wave of momentum right now, getting to his spots and keeping things simple on the offensive side. The Nets have gone 7 to 16 from the field here in the fourth. That's about 43%. Outside, Mark. There's another block. What a defensive performance. 12 blocks. Well, he's shutting them down right now. And it's Allen slamming it down. When you're Allen, just about seven feet, dunking comes easy. And for the Nets, they're shooting here in the fourth quarter around 41%. And so it's going to end up in the record books as a blowout, a dominating performance for Cleveland. It was a standout performance across the board. I mean, it was like watching a cat play with a mouse. They, they were able to do more or less whatever they wanted. And so taking a look at their record, a nice milestone they'll be picking up tonight. 30 wins on the year now. And, and once it becomes official, this win gives them a nice confidence boost against this team. They'll face them twice more this season. The one player that really stands out, of course, in this one, it was a dazzling game for MP. His overall stat line really says it all. I think a triple-double game for him, getting it done everywhere on the floor. And it's Drews missing. Thomas dishes to Walker. Here's Martin, and finished off by Martin. And not the prototype power forward, but he has tremendous athletic ability. Now, here's Bridges. He's guarded closely. Outside, Mark. And the rejection by MP. Floats it up for MP. Stolen by Mark. About three seconds between shot and game clock. 11 feet away. Bridges shot. Good. Just look at those stats from Bridges, and he is feeling it. MP against Mark. Always going up for the alley-oop here. Throws down the alley-oop slam. And you can sense that these fans, these players, they are ready to celebrate. It's always nice to perform like this, especially in front of the faithful home crowd. And so it's Cleveland taking care of business in this one. They poured it out a night. Dominant showing in front of a crowd that loved every minute of it. And, you know, this game could really...